Welcome back, everyone. We're here with the final match of Group Division 1, even. We've got Flake versus Land 9. Now, Flake, they haven't won a single game yet so far, so if we can get the scores up on, or the standings as it stands, up on the screen. Um, there we go. This is as it stands. So, N9 versus Flake. N9, if they're going to win this, you'd, you'd think that they're going to finish second in their group because they've already beat BZ and BZ versus NP is going to be happening in the background. Flake, they just want to get on the scoreboard. They've been absolutely battered and bruised so far, so they've got nothing to lose. They're going to throw it all to the defence here. Their backs are against the wall and uh, hopefully we're going to be seeing a good game. Um, just going to take you through the lineups real quick. So, lining up for Flake, we've got Yoop. Delgon, Krabya, Neo, Twister, and Dusty. And as you can see on the screen, the odds are just right down the middle. There's not much separating them. 2.07 against 1.94. I mean, that's about as 50-50 as you can get in this game. N9 li lining up with Adlad, Ditto, Zed, Nizu, Swanidius, and White Wolf. Like I say, if N9 win this, they put themselves in a really good position to get to the finals because they will be drawn against the lowest seed. So if N9 win this game, the next round of this competition will also be against Flake as they finish bottom, right? So, I mean, it's, it's all for Land 9 to win because if Flake win, who will Flake pay? They would end up playing... I don't know. I think they play NP, possibly. I think that's how it's going to work. But I think the first map's going to be ice. I'm not entirely sure. BZ versus NP. Is that on the other server, is it? So, obviously, uh, NP heavy favourites for that one. Uh, BZ have already dropped a game against N9, so this is uh, is it joint second against fourth at the moment. They're just sorting out maps as it stands, but Beach is going to be the first map. Just finding out what the second map's going to be. Okay, right. So the first map is going to be Beach, followed by Frostbite. So um, completely different maps. I mean, you couldn't get more different than those two. So this is going to be... Uh, an interesting game as we've got the camera on me you can see that I've dropped me lunch down me so I'll try and hide that I'll go like that but it looks like we're starting to get people readying up everyone's on the server it looks good if we're gonna jump into game right now I like I say flake versus n9 or lan9 as they're tagged up today Waiting on eight players to ready up, and we're going to get this one under underway. Right here we go. Then we're ready. Two players left. Let's get into game. If there's anyone that you want me to spec in particular in chat, just let me know. I'll try and find them. The shit talking from Neo is already coming out. Here we go. Map one, round one. We're on beach. N9 versus Flake. And Land 9 are going to get us underway on the attacking team here. 
as we're gonna have a look to see what Yup's gonna be doing with the Panzerfaust. He's the man to watch, I've heard. He was pretty hammered last night, so let's see what he's gonna be capable of. He's gonna pick up a double, taking out Stedens, <laughs> wanted it straight off the bat there. He's not wasting time here. He's getting straight down to business as we're gonna get on board with Krabion. Delgon with a, a needle behind him, but here come the grenades, the spam kills are coming out here from the Flake team. And this is gonna reply with a Panzerfaust kill of his own. And it, the Allied team are really starting to struggle. They, ca they just can't get close at the moment. Perhaps the uh, Axis team have got their number. Here comes the plant. Is he gonna be able to succeed? Yes, he is. So let's see what the other side's happening. We've got fire for effect. We've got an airstrike coming out. It's not going to connect with anyone. As Yoop's going to find himself a three-man Panzerfaust. He jumps over the top. Nears Adlad Wolf all taken out. Absolutely taking care of business right there. Making sure that plant did not go down first time. However, there is a dynamite set to yellow. Adlad's going to be going for it. Nades are raining in. Are they going to be able to stop him? No, they're not. Yoop's grenade takes him out a split second too late as the airstrikes and spam is just raining in on this beach. Here we go, Zed and White will push in towards the flag. Flag has been taken. Three seconds to spawn. It looks like they're gonna be safe enough to get the respawn in. Airstrikes are coming out. Get stand on board here with Zed. He's gonna be taking an absolute battering from the side. And here we go, are they gonna be able to get in? No, they're not. Because Twist is there with the uh, gift there. And uh, it's a very slow, slow but steady push from the Allied side. Dusty's going to reply with a kill onto Swanidius as the Land 9 side are starting to rack up some kills and get a bit of ground here. Saying that, I believe they've just taken the uh, the bunker back. So just like that, the Allied team are going to be pushed back to the bottom of that beach. I've been asked to follow Ditto and Dusty, so let's get on board with Ditto, see what he's going to be able to do. He's probably the loudest person at this LAN event, like you can hear him from a mile off on comms. Um, if you're sitting around the uh, spectator area, you can probably hear him over the TV. Here we go, he's going to find a kill there on Krabby, he's got a nice revive there and they're going to start pushing their way up. Panzerfaust is coming out from Niz, he connects onto Neo, but Ditto's going to continue to push down to this lower docks area. Not much in the way of resistance just yet. He's going the sneaky peeky way. Let's see if he's going to be able to do anything. Slow, steady work here from Dio. Not sure if they've got any idea that he's here. Let's find out. Nobody's in the dock room. Oh, yes, they are. He's going to find one. Is he going to be finding another? No, because there's going to be two of them. He's going to take a kill out there. And uh, he doesn't want to take the full spawn. So who was the other person you wanted to watch? You wanted to watch... Dusty. Dusty. Here we go. Dusty's on board. He's going to be pushing the uh, field ops, and the field ops has been taken down. Zed taking a long spawn there. It looks like, no, not quite. They've just had the respawn. But the Axes have reclaimed their bunker yet again as Yoop's going to find a double onto Ditto and Swanidius. He's really doing well to just put a bit of a, a blunt edge on the uh, Allies' attack. As we're gonna get, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna watch White Wolf for a bit. We've not watched him yet. Here we go. A few shots round off. He's trying to hold the spawn area, but he's not gonna hold it as Dusty takes care of business. However, they are gonna recapture just in the nick of time as Panzerfaust off trading out on either team as the spam is doing absolute wonders here for the Axis team. We're back on board with Ditto. He seems to be doing quite a bit. Saying that, Caster's cursed. Delgon's going to take care of his push there. He had no support as Swan Idius is pushing up with Niz. This is a bit more promising from the Land 9 side. Slowly making their way downstairs. Cautiously looking behind Swanidius. Here we go. He's going to be making his way in. Docks area. He's got a bit of support in the way of White Wolf. Here we go. Are they going to be able to take? Zed's there in support. Four players. Here we go. The docks are moving. Are they going to be able to move these any further? Yes, they are so far. They've got an access member there, but Dusty is going to fall. Swanidius 
Doc still in hand. He's got plenty of support as they're moving on towards this upper area. Is anything going to be able to stop them? No, it's not. Swanidius setting a time of 5 minutes 13. Very impressive there from the Land 9 side as Flake looked like they might be flaking out of this competition. Let's bring up the scoreboard, see what's going on. Yoop, as expected, carrying on the Flake side. 3k damage, 13 kills. Um, that's actually more... Oh no, it's not quite more than double as anyone because Twisted has also got 2k damage himself. Niz leading the scoreboard for the Land 9 side. 1500 damage. But it's a little easier when you're on defense to get damage. And it's going to be interesting to see how these scores start to even out over this next game. 5 minutes 13 on the clock. And I don't know if Flake have got it in them. It'd be interesting to see if they go with uh, the sniper tactic. It'd be nice to see a sniper in this game. Round two of the first map here, land nine on defense, five minutes on the clock for the, uh, I forgot their name, Flake Saita uh, beat. Both Dynamites are going to be coming out. No one's going to be stopped by the air support. Ditto connected onto Twister there. Yoop's going to be going for it. Is he going to have it? Enough charge. No, he's not, because Ditto's going to be there to deny yet again. So that Dynamite has not been planted on the, the right side, but the door has been planted. Which is the main one. Sniper rifle coming out from uh, Neo. I've, I've scrolled past him. Let's get on to Neo, see if he's going to be able to do anything. Dynamite coming in from the Allied side. This is about the same sort of progress that they were making as Neo's going to find that one kill there. His accuracy is pretty good here. I don't think he's missed a shot so far. He's going to find another kill onto an Axis player. And the Axis, scared to show their heads because they know that Neo is just taking care of anyone that pops up and it's a very very passive axis side right now as Neo seems to be doing quite a good job putting some suppressing fire twist going to be making his way up to the top he's getting some shots into the side but he's going to get through that's going to force the axis to then push on down towards and hopefully twist is going to find a bit of support in some players somewhere oh. They don't know he's gone into the tunnel, into the uh, vent even. But here we go. And we're on the player cam, uh, player cam of Twisted. We're going to keep it on him just for a bit as he's waiting for a respawn. Let's see what he's going to be able to do. Twisted on camera. So far he's gone undetected, however he has now been seen. He's going to get down safely and we have got an objective grab, let's see who's got him. Delgon, objective in hand, has he got anything, anyone coming down for support? Don't think he has just yet. Yes he has, he's got two members, this is going to be a very quick time. Three minutes still in hand and there's no Axis side players in sight just yet. Dusty's going to be making his way up. Clearing the way, he's going to pick himself up a two-man. And Delgon is clear. And there we go. Flake of one, their first map of LAN, I believe. It's going to go 1-0 to the way of Flake. The slight underdogs here. Who would have thought? Let's get those stats up. And uh, the stats did not balance out. So, LAN 9, 8,400 damage against Flakes. Almost 12 thousand damage so as is uh, standard practice we will be playing this map again I 
been planted. Affirmative. Prepare to fight. Five, Second game of the first map here. Three, two, Land 9 have dropped the map. We didn't expect to see this just yet. But let's see if we can get on board with one of the Panzerfaus. Yoop. Grenades in hand. Dropping a bit of spam out. Oh no, he's not got the Panzer this round. He's got the SMG. As they're going for a quick plant here onto the right side. Twist. And you going for the quick plant. They are going to connect with that. So good work there. Crab is on the uh, sniper rifle. Trying to support. But no one's showing himself just yet. He's going to fire one. He's going to miss. He's going to miss again. Crab what are you doing? Wake up. Oh, I've just gone past the Panzer again. I want to see what the Panzers are doing. Hold on. I will find one. Oh, we're going to get on the Sten. We've not watched anyone with a Sten yet. Delgon with Sten in hand. Airstrike coming out. Oh, he's going to kill himself out. But that airstrike is going to connect onto White Wolf. So it gives him a slight opening here. As Adlad's chucking out an airstrike. It seemed pretty aimless. I don't know if it's going to connect with anyone. No, it's not. He's going to be hit. Holding the flag with Krabia. Oh no, Swanidia, sorry. As they're firing on towards, but they're going to get the kill out. So here we go. Niz, Panzer in hand. Is he going to be able to do anything this time round? We haven't really seen much from him just yet. We've seen a few singles. Are we going to see a big multi here? Very slow ally push. There we go, Niz is going to find one onto Krabia. Going to take him down to a fairly short spawn. Both teams have got the exact same spawn time, from what I can make out. Dusty's also going to fall to Niz's Luger. And here we go, both teams spawning at the same time. Is he going to be able to connect with anything? Let's have a look. He's firing, and he's not going to find anything, and Yoop's going to take care of business. Getting a nice long-range SMG kill there. As uh, Flake are now, they're really struggling to get hold of this flag and hold it for a substantial amount of time. As saying that, they finally got the uh, flag. Here we go, you picking up a kill. Swanidius and Adlad are gonna reply, but here we go. Are they gonna be able to hold it? Yes, they are, as Dusty is there, and they're gonna successfully kill out and get the respawn, so here we go. Hopefully moving on to the second part of this map. Neo's still got the sniper in hand, picking people off, left, right, and center. Dusty's gonna get a few bullets in his back for his troubles. Going. Dusty getting away from the shots of the Axis, making his way down the stairs towards the docks. He's going to be met by Swanidius, and Swanidius wins that duel for now. Oh, and this is going to find a double. I didn't catch it, but we can see it in the, uh, the kill feed as we're on board now with Ditto. I don't know if we can get a, a Ditto camera. We can't get a ditto camera. Okay, I'll tell you what. Uh, oh, I've gone past him. We're going to get a Neo. Neo cam. So here we go. Top right of your screen, we can see Neo. Probably the best dressed bloke at LAN. Unofficial award, but I'm going to give him it. Many people are starting to turn up now to LAN. Neo making his way into the docks. No one's there to stop him. This is going to make the uh, Axis team start to fall down and try and... He's got no support. I don't know if he's going to need support because... Oh, here we go. Neo meeting the first bit of resistance and Zed is going to shut him down and return them documents. So it was, it was nice work by Flake, uh, by Neo, but none of his team were there to support as we're finding a few people now. Heading down towards. Let's let's see who else we can find. Have we got a twisted cam? Oh no, we've been on twisted. Um, hold on, Delgon. Let's get on Delgon. Let's see what Delgon's up to. Very serious looking Delgon in the top right. He's going to find a headshot. However, he is going to get dropped by White Wolf. Revive coming in though. So the al Allied side have taken control of the docks area. Docks are in hand. Delgon moving up. He's got a few players in support. They've pushed ahead. 
However, White Wolf, you sneaky devil, shoots them in the back. It isn't going to stop them because Twisted is there to save the day. However, there comes the Panzerfaust kill and they have returned the objectives. How unfortunate there. Let's get on board with Krabia. I'm sure we've got a Krabia cam. Let's see what he's up to. See how serious he looks. That's a me cam. You don't want to see me. I'm a fat mess. There we go. Good looking crab, yeah. He looks like he's gone AFK, but he's definitely there. Oh, no, he's still there. Look. He's just waiting. I don't know what he's waiting for. But he's waiting. He's, he's waiting for something. There we go. He's got the kill onto the Panzerfaust. That's a big kill. Taking care of the Panzerfaust. Onto a long spawn. He's got a 20 second respawn, the Panzer. But crab, yeah, is going to fall. As we're now going to jump across onto... Let's have a look. We're going to get on Dusty. Now, I know that Kiz in chat has been asking for Dusty. And I believe that Kiz was one of the people that flaked out on him. I'm not entirely sure that Kiz was one that flaked, but the team name's been na named after you. Poor old Dusty. He was an absolute state last night. He could barely stand. But he's, he's managed to turn up today, and he's actually doing all right. As uh, He's going to stop the Axis player there. Who was that? That was Ditto trying to reclaim the flag. Objective secured. Kids, I'm pretty sure it was you. In fact, I, I think Neo was the one that told me. I don't think it was Dusty. But... <laughs> You've disappointed me, kids. Max in chat. We could try... Uh, I won't do it, because I'll explain it to you afterwards. But we're on board with... Um, let's get on board with you. Panzer in hand for him, as the Allied side have got the objective. Is you going to be able to get up and put in some real damage onto this Axis side? He's going to fall behind the objective, and the objective is going. It's going. It's gone. Seven minutes, 14 on the clock. And this gives Flake a real opportunity. Look at the reaction from Flake. They are happy. As we're on, we're on board with them. That is um, the guy in the, the white polo. That's um, Yup. And then he's next to Krabya. But there's the whole team. That is the uh, the flake side. Um, so we've got one more round of beach. One nil to flake. N9, seven minutes to beat. Are we having deciders if it goes 2-2? Two, two? I don't know. There's no admin to ask. They're all playing, I think. But um, land centre is starting to fill up. I don't know if we can get an aerial shot of the land to see that it's starting to fill up. Uh, Just while we're waiting for people to join. Um, uh, it, it looks empty. It, it really doesn't... Everyone's around the corner. Like, if you can see the white wall, everyone's behind there. But um, we are going live. Here we go. Last round. Ditto. Sniper in hand. Let's see if he's going to be able to find anything. He's spying them out. Not taking the shot yet. Here we go. He's starting to rain down shots. Axis running for their lives. They don't want any part of it as the suppression fire is going to stop the um, the Axis advance from stopping the, uh, the plant coming out. And the plant has been successfully done on the right hand side as... Ditto is raining some shots down. Let's see what Yoop's up to. He's got Panzer in hand, but he's going to get taken down as Ditto. No, it wasn't. It was White Wolf's SMG that's taking care of Yoop there. But here we go. Not quite sure what's going on here. They're knifing some chairs and whatever. Furniture destroyers.
failed yet again, Yoop. He does not look happy. Look at him in camera. He looks absolutely furious with himself. As we're going to get on board with Crabia. Crabia, he's going to get taken down by Swan Idiots. And do you know what? I think the Land 9 side have started to turn up because they, they want it. They really want this. Here we go. Knees. Pistol in hand. Here comes the Panzer. He's going to shoot. Is he going to find anything? Yes, he is. Yoop's going to be taken down. That's Panzer versus Panzer. However, the Land 9 side have not got control of the flag. They've lost it again. But Flake Neo... He's had to fall all the way back. So they're clearly worried about someone that's pushed in past them. As White Wolf is going to get taken back down by Delgon. As um, there seems to be fights and carnage all over the place. Land 9 side really need to come together here. As Swan Idius has taken the objectives. He's going to need some support. Because no doubt the Flake side will start pushing him. And there we go. Dusty taking care of business. And I believe that was a full spawn for Swan Idius. So let's have a look. See what Ditto's up to there. Crazy K's. Thank you. I, I have got that bound uh, to a button, but um, I keep forgetting to press it. I'm not going to lie. Number three, yeah. Number three. We've got... Oh, no, no, no. I've got it. I've got it bound. Yeah, here we go. Ditto. He's going to find one onto Twisted. He's going to slowly make his way down. Grenades being chucked up at him, taking him down to 20 HP. He's going to have to fall back to recoup a bit of health. Waiting to see if the Axis are going to push him. Axis have just respawned. And Land 9 side. Very disjoint attack again. you think that if they could come together and form a decent attack all together, that you're going to do stuff. White Wolf and Ditto. Might be those two to do something. Here we go. Three people in the objective room slowing that attack down. Ditto and White Wolf taking turns. Here we go. A revive's coming in. From the flake side. There's only four minutes left on the clock for Land 9 to do something here. Or they're going to have to go the, the long way and potentially take it to a third map. Here we go. Nears Panzer in hand. He doesn't want to do anything just yet. Here we go. He's going to shoot. He's going to shoot and there he's going to co connect onto Crabia. That's going to be the opening that the Allies need. Surely as... Delgon, Neo and Dusty all picking one up for the flake side, but Delgon's going to get taken down by Ditto. Here we go, Ditto, objective in hand. The Axis side aren't going to spawn for another 10 seconds. Is Ditto going to be able to get away? No, he's not. He's going to slow himself down. I don't know what happened there. Twisted is going to shut him down, take the documents back, and the Land 9 side are going to have to regroup here. Hold on. Can't do it. Help. Sorry about that. You had black screen. Which one's flake? Um, None of them got their names. Wait, 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 wait. I need a resin docks. Take it slow. Two, two. Take it slow, guys. One, one portion, one portion. Down. Four, right here, right here. I'm on, I'm on. Oh, come on. Getting killed again. Panzer was there, so. One bot, my radar says, Dusty. We need help in the middle Just of this. Just one bot, my radar says, that's it. Go together now, fire the rising. Go long, guys, go long. Spawn in soon, spawn in soon, go long. Medic here, medic here, dead. I need, ammo. I need ammo long, Oscar. Me too, I have pistol. Oh, three, three out. out. Yeah, I got one as well. One on top of the radio, sir. Oh, Medic. I think the Panzer was revived. Yeah, it was. I couldn't keep him. Two Stay together, guys. Panzer's in radio. Aiden, ready medic long, medic long, medic long, dogs. My god, go long. It's okay, it's okay. You have them, you have them. Both on, there's two, ah, oh, there's three left, but they're pushing down short. Sound muted. Well, that was um, Land 9's very hectic 
speaking channel there is uh, Swan Elias was shot in the back. We've got one minute, 15 left on the clock. I was going to try and join um, Flake's TeamSpeak channel, but they're not on TeamSpeak. I'm not sure how they're communi communicating, but Swan Elias, objective in hand. One minute, five seconds on the clock. Adlad's going to be supporting. Here we go. They've gone the long way. Two kills coming out from Zed and Ditto. Neo's going to reply with a kill onto his own of Ditto's. The call is going to be... Start pushing shortly. The axe is spawning 10 seconds. If they're going to go, surely it's going to be now. Here we go. They're going to be shot from behind and Twisted taking care of business yet again. And I believe that is going to be good games. I'm not entirely sure that they've got enough time just yet. And I believe Twisted just won the game for Flake. And that will take the score. Two points to zero as Flake showing that they've got a bit of life left in them yet. 15 seconds left on the clock. It's not going to be enough time as they're just throwing themselves at the objective and the Flake team are just going to be picking them off one by one. Five seconds left and this map is all but done. Congratulations, Flake. You have won two rounds back to back considering that you hadn't won any before this map. You've just won it twice. Perhaps Beach is your map. But scoreboard's looking fairly even in that one across the boards. Uh, five... K damage done more by the land nine side, even though they lost. So, looks like we're going to be taking a smoke break. So, the next map is going to be Frostbite, and we'll be with you shortly.
Flake taking a surprising 2-0 lead if we can get an update on the scoreboard. Land 9 are going to get us underway on the attacks. Twisted Sportfire taking care of two players from the Land 9 side. Dynamite's down. It is yellow. Is it going to turn red? Yes, it is. Nice work there from Adlad. He's going to get a very fast plant down. I think I might be being graced. Oh, Yuke's going to get a three-man Panzerfaust. I missed it because I was talking. I'm sorry about that. But here we go. Let's see what Dastardy's going to be able to do. See if he's going to be able to continue to hold this upper flag area. Dynamite has exploded, giving the Allies a second place to attack. Everyone who seems to be specking is dying. Dale gone down to 37 HP. He's going to be peeking over the top. He knows there's people down there. Grenades are going to be coming out. Dale going to be throwing a nice airstrike. That's surely going to take care of that allied push. No, it's not, because they're all going to self-kill anyway. Axis are quite content on letting them kill out. I believe they've got the spawn area. Yes, they have. So, land nine. Not whole, uh, wasting any time here. Niz with a double. Uh... Pans fell straight off the Axis spawn there. They've got 10 seconds for the respawn to come out. Twisty looks like he's going to be pushing out. Chuck the grenade down, seeing if he can find anything. The grenade has exploded, but it's not taking any of the Allied players down. Ditto's got himself into a nice full position. He has been spotted by an Axis player, I believe. Not entirely sure. Yes, here we go. Ditto has been spotted by Twisted, and Twisted is going to take care of Ditto in that lower area. Was it double full hold? I don't think it was. They set a timer. Mm hmm. Oh, you with a three man Panzer Faust taking down White Wolf, Swanidius, and Zed. And that's going to take care of him with a grenade. However, that was nice work there from the Panzer Faust for the Flake side. And Flake are really starting to step things up this game. They might not have won a single map before this game, but they are definitely taking the game now to land nine. They don't want to have give them that easy, easy seeding. Panzer in hand. He's got. Oh, he's got a knife. Is he going to... Oh, I don't know if he's been spotted. He's going to get a couple of bullets in the back. Pistol. No. It's not necessary. He's going to save his Panzer Faust charge. And he's going to kill out. If there's anyone that you would like me to spec in chat, uh, spec in this game, please let me know in chat and I'll, uh, I'll get it sorted. Hopefully. Let's jump on with Swanidius, see what he's been able to do. He's heading back there. Must be changing where they want. As, uh, oh no, the reason they're changing is because the Axis have sneakily taken the flag back. But Swanidius is there to recapture the flag in order to get the Allies respawning up front. Six minutes left on the clock. is a good, good bit of defense coming in from the flake side as Land 9 really look like they're starting to struggle. I'm not sure if it's apparently Neo's already on his sixth beer or eighth beer, I think it might be. It might be worth getting a Neo cam on, see how shit faced he looks. Let's see if we can get a Neo cam. He's swaying a bit. Oh my god, he is swaying big time there. Neo, he is shit. Look at him. We're laying down some support fire on towards the uh, the side as Yoop's going to take care of two of the attacking land nine players. Most of his team are going to kill out, but Neo's going to hold strong, taking it further back.
feel like I'm in the Matrix. I'm being filmed. I think what's happening is Neo's been told just hold right back because you're so drunk. You're so drunk, Neo. We don't trust you. And he's just going rogue. No, he's not. Look, he's been told again. Get back, Neo. You're not allowed to do anything. I'm not, I'm not going to spec Neo because he's not doing anything. If I come off him now, though, I know that he's going to get like a three-man kill. But, um, let's see if he's going to do anything. No, he's just going to continue to not do anything. So we're going to start swapping off. Twisted. Grenade in hand. Going to be chucking it on towards this ally player in the lower area, but he's not going to find him. And this is a very impressive defense coming out as Ditto and Niz are going to find two Axis players on full spawn. She'd like to think that finally the Allies might be able to start pushing through. Here we go. Zed pushing up. MP40 in hand. He's going to get dropped. He's going to get a revive, but the kills are coming out. Crabgy's just picked up three. Twisted with one of his own. Delgon getting in on the action. And you know what? That's another Land 9 attack completely shut down. And if you're part of N9 right now, you've got to be asking yourself, boys, they haven't won a single map yet. And we're just letting them win. Here's Panzer in hand. He's going to find one on the Delgon. However, Yuke's Panzer's going to find two. The more effective of the Panzers taking care of the attack from side. As Ditto's going to be dropping down. He's going to be supported by a few of his teammates. And here we go. Crabgy. He's been dropped. The call has been get those ejectors and get them gone. As we're going to stick on board with Ditto right now. Yoop's going to find a kill onto White Wolf. So they are going to be pushing these objectives. And Ditto's going to get shut down by Delgon. And that is going to be that. Doc Run taken care of. This Axis side looks strong right now. And you've got to be asking yourself, what were they, what were they doing earlier? As Delgon's going to find a nice kill there onto Niz, shutting down the Panzerfaust. Both teams about to respawn. Here we go. Flake getting back into position. Delgon's going to be heading towards the service area. Let's see if he's able to do anything. Add that. Drop. Give. Two more players there. Coming up. And Yoop's going to find them both. Oh, he's going to find two of the three with his Panzerfaust. Swanidius and Niz both taken down as Delgon's slowly creeping up. He knows there's a player there. Is he going to find them? No, he's not. They must have fallen all the way back. As he's going to get the kill out. So let's get on board with... Um, Yoop, because he's the one with the plan right now. He's going to find Ditto straight off the spawn. Great work there from the the uh, Dutch, I believe he's Dutch, Dutch superstar. As we can see, he looks very relaxed in his chair. And the, uh, <laughs> the Axis players are finally starting to mount some sort of attack. However, Delgon, he's going to find one. He's going to find two before getting shut down. No Gibbs coming out just yet. As Yoop's got Panzer in hand, we're expecting big things now from Yoop. Let's see if he's got anything. No, he's not. Zed's going to take care of the Panzerfaust, and he's not going to let him get any more doubles. Not just yet, however, as the Land 9 side are starting to attack this service area. Four players down here, and there comes a nice double kill from Niz. Pistol and a Panzer. And here we go. Oh, Axis are taking care of the... Uh, flag but the allies have retaken it so we're going to get on board with the uh, document carrier ditto docks in hand white wolf here to support he's going to get shut down down by twisted ditto double revise coming out checking his back just making sure there's nothing here we go are they going to be able to reclaim these documents no delgon's going to get taken down three players have just been taken out from the uh, defending side however ditto Heavy pressure from behind. Flake have killed out. 30 seconds left to set a time. 30 seconds, let's go. Here we go, Ditto's going. He's going to get shut down. Double support fire from Zed, but guess what? White Wolf, Doc's in hand. 20 seconds left on clock. 9 minutes 39. It was a slow attack, but they have set a time. If we bring up the scoreboard right now, Niz... 4,000 damage leading the way for the land nine side. However, you unsurprisingly, 5,700 damage. There's a huge differential in uh, damage given for both sides. We've got 
basically 20,000 damage against 13,000 damage. I mean, the differences right now are absolutely huge between these two sides. And you would not think that the land knight side were coming in as slight favourites. We are live. Second round of the second map. Flake. Nine minutes thirty to beat. Zed support fire doing some work. Let's get on board with Deo. Deo seems to be doing quite a bit for this land nine side. He's not being able to be as effective as what you'd think he would be. As Adlad's going to find a double MP40 kill. The dynamite has gone down on the service door. For flake. Yoop. Panzer. Ready to pop. However, this is grenade. It's going to shut that Panzer Faust down. So far, the Axis team do look quite content. But the service door has been blown. Here we go. Flake are going to start self killing. This is surely going to be the time for them to start pushing in as the land nine side are also going to get the self kills in. Go on, Flake. Let's do it. Straight up top. Is there going to be any resistance? No, there's not. And Delgon. And uh, his team have taken that forward spawn. They're just going to sit here and be quite content as they've got five seconds left of the respawn. Ditto's going to try and stop him. He's going to get shut down by Dusty. And the respawn is coming in. Niz unable to uh, reclaim just yet. Let's see if we can get on Niz. Oh, you another double from him. I want to get on Niz. Niz has just picked up a kill onto Dusty. Allied side about to get the respawn in. Let's see if we can find anything because Yoop's going to be in perfect position for the respawn on the Axis team. Panzer in hand. Panzer fired. Panzer connects only onto Swanidius. However, Twisted has got himself a kill as well. Niz is going to find one back with the Panzer Faust of his own. And he's going to follow up with a Luger as well. But Yoop pushing the Axis spawn. Ditto's going to hold the Axis spawn strong. But as I say that, Crabgy. Docks in hand, taking its service. Not sure if there's anyone from the Axis side alive just yet. It seems fairly clear. As we're going to be zooming ahead, I'm going to try and get this. Just to see what's going on. As Delgon's going to be pushing down the land nine side, finding three kills back to back. I'm not sure if I've, I've missed um, where the documents have gone. They seem to have been dropped somewhere. No one's got the objective just yet. Oh, here we go. Delgon, dogs in hand. Axis have taken control of the transmitter. However, the kills are coming in for the flake side. Swanidius might be one of the only people left. Saying that, Niz and Ditto on the scene. Ditto's going to pick himself up a double. And I don't know where the objective is. Right, Delgon, objective still in hand. Quite I mean, they've got 16 minutes and 15 seconds on the clock. They've got plenty of time to beat. Don't rush it. Don't give this good opportunity away just yet. Perhaps he's taking, <laughs> taking uh, control of the upper area. As we're going to try and see what's going on on the comms. Hold on, let me see if I can do this. Spice. Inside the voices you'll be now. able to hear now. Good one at trans. I'm up top. Guys, I'm up top. Right, this one blaming. Yeah, okay, Swan is full. Oh, dead. This oh, one ladder. A flake. I'll shoot them full now. I'm up top. Guys, come on, come up the ladder. Get this full. There's two in. I'm coming up with docks. We're coming over wall. We're coming over wall now. Uh, there's one up the ladder. Knees here. Knees here. Knees is below us. Okay. Nice. There's one more lower. I'll come back. Don't, 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 don't. There's two dead. Two dead. Two dead. Two dead. <laughs> so much shouting. Three, three inside, three inside. Three. Coming up, coming up, coming up, coming up. Alright, Dogon. Oh, I'll go for ducks. I'll go for ducks just in case. One behind you, Dogon. One behind you, Dogon. 
No way. Okay, Twister, has it quickly. Yeah, uh, maybe. I might board. have it. If any. And that was on board with the flake side. It seemed a bit chaotic. However, Twisted, as you heard, was going straight towards the documents just in case they lost it. And they did lose it. However, Ditto has got the respawn, taken him down, and returned the documents. So now it's all back to the drawing board for the flake side with 4 minutes 45 on the clock. Ditto is going to win the Battle of the Brits as Dusty is going to get dropped by his MP40. Zed sneaking up the back. Oh no, he's not. He's holding the back because he's on defence. Shows you how much I know. I think all the Allied side are dead at the moment. I can't see anyone. Here we go. Respawn coming out. Niz. Just going to drop a grenade on himself. You can feel something big here. He's boiling. Panzer in hand. Not much is happening just yet. This is just waiting, biding his time. The Allied respawn is going to be coming in. And there comes the big self kill. Panzer out, and he's going to find three. You crabbed your Neo, all taken out on a full spawn there. Fantastic work there by Niz. He just bided his time. I'm glad I stuck with him for so long. As he's going to be shooting up and he's going to take out Twisted as well. That's four on the board there for Niz. Nice work there as he's starting to step it up for the land nine side. As I say that, Flake have taken the uh, flag back. Three minutes 15 to get another point on the board. Or will it be the land nine side? As Niz is going to find a double onto Dusty and Crabyard service. And Land 9 side do seem quite comfortable since they've reclaimed them documents. This is much better, much better from the Land 9 side. I believe they might have got um, Neo to sober up as they seem to have absolute map control here. Niz, another double onto Neo and you. You, Panzer for Flake. Big weapon taken away from them. Oh, he's got another double. Crabbed you and Delgon this time. You know what? I don't know why I'm following anyone else other than uh, Niz right now. Because he just seems to be bringing that absolute pain time and time again. He's going to not catch the uh, Allied point just quite. However, he likes playing this slow game. Just watching to see what they're going to do. Where they're going to push. And here we go. He's going to wait. He's going to wait. He's going to find one. And uh, Yoop is going to kill himself, denying him the second man kill there. It's a bit, bit cheap. However, he's managed to push himself all the way out here. And he's going to throw a couple of grenades out. Don't know if any of them are going to quite connect. As neither is the airstrike. But the Land 9 side have worn the clock right down to two minute, uh, one minute and two seconds. Time slowly wearing out for the flake side. You'd think they might only have one, possibly two attacks left. Flag captured. 45 left on the clock. Dusty and Neo pushing up services. They've got Twist in there for help. However, Niz going to be insta-giving him with a grenade. No, it wasn't an insta-give. Still three players pushing. 30 seconds. Swan Idiot finds two. He's surely going to find the third. Yes, he is. Twisted also taken down by Swinidius' uh, MP40 there. And Flake look like they are all flaked out. 15 seconds and it is all but over on this second round. 
and Land 9 are going to say we are still in this. And the score is going to be two maps to one. The Axis win. As we're going to bring up the scoreboards right now. Take us to a beer right back. Second map of this uh, four, no, sorry, it's the fourth map of this four part series. Flake took it, taking the early advantage, two rounds to zero, but N9 have finally clawed one back. And that is quick. That is quick from the uh, flake side taking upper control. They've already got the flag within the first minute and it's very hard for you to do that. However, dynamite planting the service. Crabdew's gonna hold that. Adlad holding, holding strong for the uh, Axis side. Let's see if we can get any uh, action. Near's grenade in hand. He's not gonna find anyone just yet. There comes the respawn. Both teams have now respawned. Oh dear, Niz has taken a teammate out with that shot as well. But the service door has been breached. Let's see if the allies are going to make any sort of push here. As Dero's going to find two, he's not going to find any more. But Niz's grenade is surely going to take care of that third man. And it is. What's going on? Is he going to kill out? No. What's happening here? He's going to look for someone, but Niz is going to get shut down. And he's going to draw a blank this time round, as Delgon's going to nail one in his head. And if you want anyone specced in particular, please let me know, because um, I will spec them. I, I didn't realise I'd been disconnected from chat, but I'm back in chat now. So if there's anyone in particular you want to watch, let me know in chat. Land 9 seem to be in full control of this map yet again. As the last map, they just took care of business. Niz, three man Panzerfaust, Neo, Dupe, Delgon, all suffering at the hands of this, uh, I believe he's Finnish superstar. Come on, you. Give me something to spec. Not much. He's, he's found one onto Adlad on a very short spawn, but he's got the respawn off as well. You, another kill on the knees. That's gonna slow. Uh, that's gonna put a dent into the defence as Niz has been carrying quite a bit in the last couple of rounds. One of these trying to hold on to this area. He's got a bit of support, however. 
Delgon's going to get both of them. White Wolf and Sni Swanidia is both taken down. It looks like they're going to have to concede this. Yes, they are. They're going to concede it. Delgon, dogs in hand. It's going to be a bit of pressure coming in. From the active side, Adlad's going to find two. And he's going to get the... No, he's not going to quite re uh, return them. Dusty. Now the dock carrier. This is big. This is big. Flake finally going to be successful on this attack, it seems. The docks are running. Is there going to be anyone else to slow things down? Yes, there is. Swanidia slowing things down. Are they going to be able to do anything? Duke, double Panzerfaust. Duke is going to be... Doesn't know whether to go. He's been given the green light. And there it is. Four minutes, 22 on the clock. And we're on player cam for Yoop. He looks absolutely out of it. He's pretty hungover from what I can understand. I know he was getting a bit of, a bit of stick in chat for uh, his Red Bull racing top. We'll be right back. We're starting. We're underway. The final round of this very closely contested game. White Wolf going for the plant. He is going to be successful before Crafty is going to find three. White Wolf News and Swanidius all being taken down by his support fire. And Zed is pushing up the back. He's going to get um, an Axis player spawn right into his face. However, that is going to be an advantage for the Allies because they now know the exact spawn time, you would think. As, Swanidi uh, as Twisted is going to get two-man support fire. Niz is going to find one on the Delgon. And here we go. Land 9. Try not to hold things back now. You've really let yourself down on the game of beach earlier, but they are taking matters into their own hand on Frostbite. I'm not sure if we're going to have a decide or if it ends as a draw, but you'd think 3 minutes 20 is plenty of time for this land nine side who have got the momentum behind them. Niz is going to find one onto Yoop, and Yoop's going to be taken down. He is the Panzerfaust for the Axis side. Dynamite, plan. Dynamite coming down. And White Wolf. Unable to get the revive as Delgon and Dusty are both going to find a frag of their own. Delgon's going to follow out with another. Revive is coming out to the Allied side. They're going to be pushing up towards the docks. It's pretty uncontested. There's only one or two players up there. Crabgy, last man standing it looks like. As uh, White Wolf's having a hard time getting up the stairs. And there comes the respawn in from the Axis side. Not sure why he took so long to get up there. You need trick jumping lessons, sir. As Yoop's going to kill himself and Adlad with the Panzer. But he knows that the, uh, the respawns are coming in at the same time for both teams. And Twisted has retaken the flag back. So just like that, the land nine side are back to square one. Airstrike drawing a blank. Another one coming in. Is it going to find anyone? Not quite yet. Niz also draws a blank. The Flake team have arrived and they might be taking this to three rounds to one. As I'm being asked, am I playing in underdogs? The, the answer to that is yes. I will be uh, playing Panzer later on for Team Underdogs. Here we go. Nears Panzer in hand. He's going to find one onto you. That's going to be a big frag for the Land 9 side if it was a give. However, Dusty, Crabgy, 
both getting kills. So Anidius is going to get a double of his own before getting a couple of revives. Ditto's pushing up. Respawn's coming in from the Allied side. They've got about two more attacks left to save the, this game. Saber, save the game. Allies. Now pushing in. Swanidis taking down what's twisted. There's a couple of players from the Allied side pushing towards service. Frags traded either way. But it looks like the flake side are going to have to regroup. The self kills are coming in. No support. Here comes the support. Swan Idius. One revive. Pabji's going to get one. Panther's coming out, and there goes you taking care of things again. However, we've got an objective grab. Adlad. He's going to be slowed down by a grenade. Takes half his health out. 30 seconds on the clock. This is going to be a very, very tight game. I don't know if they're going to chase him or if they're just going to go back. Surely they're going to go back. Niz is going to find one straight off of the spawn. And that's a big kill on uh, Neo. And it looks fairly evenly contested here. No, it's not. Oh, my God. I don't even know where the doctor has gone. Swan idiot. Got a commission hand. He's going to get away. Oh, there's one player left from the exit side. Is he going to do it? Yes, he is. In one second on the clock. And oh, my good God. What a way to end things. One second left on the clock. Well, it says there's two seconds, but I'm pretty sure I saw one second left on the clock. Swanidius saving the game for the land nine side. And uh, that's two games to two. Absolutely incredible scenes. Let's bring up the scoreboard for you. Uh, it all got a bit chaotic there at the end. I didn't know if uh, what was really happening. But um, good games being called. I'm not sure if there's going to be a deciding map or is it a draw? I'm uh, looking to my admin to my right. Is it a draw? It's a draw. So two games to two. Um, guys, we're going to set up the, our games for, for two now. So, uh, I'm being told that we're... Uh, well, I'm setting up. They're turning up the game, so we're up next, right? Yeah, I'm playing next. Is it it's getting streamed as well. Big game. Yeah. Big you game. Can do, you can do both. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you very much, guys, for tuning in. Hopefully I didn't destroy your ears too much. And um, we're going we're gonna to go to uh, some music now, I believe, and uh, some clips. So see you later.